ICDTV.net Dividend Report is brought to you in part by 1M3 Corporation, IT Solutions for Banking and Finance. Call them at 917-686-3485. I'm John Hanna, and here are the CDTV.net Dividend Report for Tuesday, May 26, 2009. CDTV.net covers dividend-paying stocks earnings reports, dividend announcements, and company profiles. But first, here's today's CDTV.net Top Stories. Barnes & Noble Incorporated reported first quarter net loss from continuing operations was $0.04 cents per share, compared to a net loss of a penny last year. Analyst average estimates were looking for a loss of $0.15 cents per share. Barnes & Noble beats by $0.11. Cents. Total sales for the first quarter were $1.1 billion, a 4% decrease compared to the prior year. Barnes & Noble Incorporated operates as a bookseller in the United States and the District of Columbia. The Toro Company reported net earnings of $1 per share compared to $1.60 per share last year. Analyst average estimates were $0.90 cents per share. The Toro Company beats by $0.10. Cents. Net sales of $499.9 million for its fiscal second quarter ended May 1, 2009, compared to $638.5 million last year. The Toro Company provides outdoor maintenance equipment and beautification products to help customers care for commercial and residential properties and agricultural fields. Nordson Corporation reported diluted earnings per share were $0.41 cents compared with $0.97 cents last year. Analyst average estimates were $0.26 cents per share. Nordson beats by $0.15 cents per share. For the first quarter ending April 30, revenue was $189 million compared with $294 million last year. Nordson Corporation manufactures equipment used for precision dispensing, testing and inspection, and surface preparation and curing. And now, the dividend report. Johnson & Johnson announced that its board of directors has declared a 6.5% increase in the quarterly dividend rate from $0.46 cents per share to $0.49 cents per share. The next quarterly dividend is payable on June 9 to shareholders of record as of May 26, 2009. Johnson & Johnson engages in the research and development, manufacture, and sale of various products in the healthcare field worldwide. Advance America Cash Advance Centers Incorporated Board of Directors declared a regular quarterly dividend of six and a quarter cents per share. The dividend will be payable on June 5 to stockholders of record as of May 26, 2009. Advance America Cash Advance Centers Incorporated provides payday cash advance services in the United States, the United Kingdom, and Canada. Schweitzer Maduit International Incorporated announced a quarterly common stock dividend of fifteen cents per share. The dividend will be payable on June 29 to stockholders of record on May 26, 2009. Schweitzer Marduit International Incorporated manufactures and sells paper and reconstituted tobacco products to the tobacco industry. Allied World Assurance Company Holdings Limited Board of Directors has declared a quarterly dividend of $0.18 cents per common share. The dividend will be payable on June 11 to shareholders of record on May 26, 2009. Allied World Assurance Company Holdings Limited, together with its subsidiaries, operates as a specialty insurance and reinsurance company in Bermuda, Ireland, Switzerland, the United States, and the United Kingdom. Equifax Incorporated announced that the Board of Directors declared a quarterly dividend of four cents per share, payable on June 15 to shareholders of record as of the close of business on May 26, 2009. Equifax empowers businesses and consumers with information they can trust. For more information about these dividends and other announcements, go to cdtv.net.